first position the turning tool by typing tool number 3 in the T text field of the CNC display window. After typing tool number in the text box, click on T button in the CNC display window. This positions the tool 3 automatically for the further action as required. Now tool offsets for the turning tool is to be set. To set the X offset of the tool, first touch the, touch the tool to the circumference surface of the billet by moving the tool manually in X and Z directions as required. To move the tool manually to touch the circumference of the billet, first click on manual X, Z and then click on minus buttons in the CNC control window. Now the tool moves in minus Z direction as seen. Just observe the tool movement in the machine and the mouse movement in the software interface. Here when the software is being operated according to that machine operates parallelly. Now touch the tool to the circumference of the billet. Now click on X minus button in CNC control. This moves the tool in minus X direction. So as seen tool 3 is touched to the circumference of the billet. Now set X offset for tool 3. To set X offset, go to job or tooling, tool offsets, click on X offset field of tool 3. Enter the diameter of the billet as 25mm. Thereby X offset for tool 3 is set. Click on OK. Now after setting X offset, Z offset for tool 3 is to be set. To set Z offset for tool 3, make the tool to touch the diameter surface of the billet manually. To move the tool, click on manual Z plus the tool moves in Z positive direction as seen. Now click on X minus to move the tool in X negative direction. Again, click on Z minus to move the tool in Z negative direction until the tool touches the billet. Now the tool touches the billet to set the Z offset for tool 3 go to job tooling tool offsets click on Z offset field of tool 3 it automatically sets the Z offset for tool 3 click OK by now, setting offsets for tool 3 is completed. So move the tool to home position by clicking on home X and home Z options in the software. Now the tool is moving to its home position. Now position tool 2 to set the work offsets. To position tool 2, type number 2 in tool text box in CNC display and click on T button as seen. When T button is clicked, turret positions tool 2 automatically as seen. Always the tool turret rotates in clockwise direction to position the required tool. Therefore tool 2 is positioned for the further action and now the tool offsets for tool 2 is to be set. To set the X offset for tool 2, touch the tool 2 to the circumference surface of the billet. To move the tool manually, click on manual Z in CNC display and minus on CNC control. Now the tool is moving in Z negative direction as shown.
Now click on X in CNC display and minus button to move the tool in X negative direction. It can be noticed that X and Z position values in CNC display is changing when the tool is moving in a particular direction. Now the tool touches the circumference surface of the billet. Move tool in X, Z negative direction and X negative direction to exactly touch the tool to the surface. Now go to job or tooling, tool offsets, click on X offset field of tool 2. Enter the diameter of the billet as 25 mm. It sets the X offset for tool 2. Now to set the Z offset for the tool 2, make the tool 2 to touch the diameter surface of the billet. To move the tool, click on manual X positive buttons to move the tool in X positive direction. Again click on Z plus buttons to move the tool in Z positive direction. Again click on X negative button to move the tool in X negative direction. At last click on Z negative button to touch the tool 2 to the diameter of the billet. Now to set the Z offset for the tool 2 go to job or tooling tool offsets click on Z offset field of tool 2. It automatically sets the Z offset for tool 2. By now, work offsets for tool 2 is completed. So again, move the tool 2 to the home position by clicking on home X and home Z options in the software. Now the tool is moving to its home position. Now position tool 5 to set the work offsets. To position tool 5, type number 5 in the tool text box in the CNC display and click on T button. When the T button is clicked, turret positions tool 5 automatically as seen. Therefore, tool 5 is positioned for the further action and now the tool offsets for tool 5 is to be set. To set the X offset for tool 5, touch the tool 5 to the circumference surface of the billet. To move the tool manually, click on manual, Z and minus button to move the tool in the Z negative directions. Now the tool is moving in Z negative direction. Now click on X negative button to move the tool in X negative directions. Now the tool touches the circumference surface of the billet. To set the X offset for tool 5, go to job or tooling, tool offsets, click on X offset field of tool 5. Enter diameter of the billet as 25 mm. The X offset for tool 5 is set. Click OK. To set the Z offset for tool 5, touch the tool 5 to the diameter of the surface. To move the tool, click on manual, X and plus buttons to move the tool in X positive direction. Now click on Z plus buttons and move the tool in Z positive directions. Again click on X minus button and move the tool in X negative direction. And at last click on Z and minus button to move the tool in Z negative direction until the tool touches the diameter of the billet. To set the Z offset for tool 5, go to job or tooling, 
tool offsets click on z offset field of tool file it automatically sets the z offset value as shown by now setting work offsets for tool 5 is completed so again move the tool to the home position by clicking on home x and home z options in the software now the tool is moving to its home position Now the machine is ready to perform the machining operations as per the part program prepared. To start the machining, close the door. Now go to machine options, check the next, next move USB is kept on. Also check the machine link.